line though, right? Like that's the, that's the line that I believe is getting really blurred out. It's, it's, it's not black and white anymore. It's very gray as opposed to being easy to understand where, where people fall on that line and what they should focus on. Because, you know, look at bodybuilders. They've built their bodies into things that you are like, wow. And some of them are dying at 40 years old. Mm-hmm. And then you also have circumstances where people are incredibly out of shape and they're being told in real life, you're a beautiful girl. Keep doing just what you're doing. You're fabulous. This is more like a woman thing. Men don't really do that to themselves. Actually, let's dive into that for a second. I've noticed a real surge in women wanting to go out of their way to make all the other women feel good about themselves, no matter what. I don't normally see that amongst men. I do see men being a little bit more firm, be like, nah, you need to lose some weight, dude. Like, it's just not good for you. Um, have you, one, seen this in society? And if so, why do you think that is? Oh, for sure, you know, you will have all different kinds of, uh, you know, focus that people will have towards somebody else, okay? As a professional, my, my, my point here is not to, you know, talk about uh, how somebody looks or doesn't look. Uh, my idea is more regarding health. So if somebody needs to lose weight, Somebody needs to lose weight. Oh, but I like being big. Okay, it's a choice. But you need to lose weight because that is uh, jeopardizing your you, health. You've heard people say that? I like being big? Oh, yeah. There are some people that uh, say that. Now, I don't care. You believe care when they say I that? Do. And it's fine. Okay, you, can, you, you, are, you are a free person. You will uh, make the decisions you want. Now, the real deal is not about your appearance, it's about health. Now, is your health important to you? Somebody may say, I don't care. I just want to enjoy life. And some people feel like enjoying life has to do with you know, just doing whatever, eating whatever, drinking whatever. So people will have different approaches towards life. Uh, personally, as a professional, my, my uh, responsibility is to tell people, look, your um, blood profile does not look good, okay? You are a candidate to have cardiovascular disease. You are a candidate to become a diabetic, okay? So it's my place to tell people, as a professional, I would advise you to change your lifestyle. Now, what the person is going to do, that's up to her. Yeah. Uh, some people will take the route of, I don't want to change my lifestyle. Just give me a pill. Okay? So, the person will have to look for a doctor who's going to give her a pill. Okay? Yeah. Because I don't want to change my lifestyle. It's a choice that people make. That's the beauty of living in a free society. You choose. So to me, I I don't really get too involved in the whole how you look and how you don't look. Uh, To me, the important thing is, look, as a professional, here's the situation. You need to do some changes in order to be, uh, to stay uh, healthier, to live longer, to be with the people you love the longest. Now, if you don't care about that, okay, it's your choice. You have been told the reality. You do whatever you want to do with that reality. All right, thanks for watching this clip from Appropriate Culture. If you want to watch the full episode, go ahead and check out us at appropriateculture.com. You can also check us out on social media platforms at Appropriate Culture. Like, subscribe. And we'll see you guys on the next one.